provolone cheese, and placed on a fresh baked Italian roll. The General Store on 24 in Lewis. Radio check one, two, one, two. Jessica's juice is on Power 1017. All right, 843, Jess, uh, what you got Here today? Here we go. So Jack Harlow and Lil Nas X lead this year's Video Music Award nominations with seven nominations apiece. That's huge. MTV also made an announcement yesterday that Doja Cat and Harry Styles they picked up six nominations. Madonna, who reigns the most awarded artist in MTV history with 20 wins, wow. has become the only artist to be nominated in each of the VMA's five decades. Isn't that crazy? Crazy. Wow. So the complete list is online, um, but they're going to be doing, of course, the video of the year, artist of the year, song of the year, best new artist, just to name a few. So get ready for that. Also, uh, Drake. You know how that app, like the Celebrity Jets, like tracks famous people's short private jet flights and it burns like tons of fuel and people decide to like drag all these celebrities in the media for it. Well, Drake is the latest one. Okay. People think that it's ridiculous that these celebrities take these private jets on these small flights and the fuel and all this stuff. Anyway, um, Drake says... It is what it is, and this is just them moving planes to whatever airport they're going to be stored at for anybody who's interested in knowing the logistics on how all this works behind the scenes. Sometimes people may be on that flight, sometimes not. Well, people are coming forward defending Drake, saying, time is money, folks. If you're hating, you're broke, <laughs> okay? <laughs> but others are not buying that excuse, saying, you're still using the same amount of fuel regardless of whether it's carrying people or not. So apparently this is like a big thing in the news and making the headlines and people are, you know, upset with Drake, but he's defending the short flights that people are mad about. All right. So people. All right. So hold on a minute. I, I didn't I'm not understanding anything that you're talking. Celebrities about. have private jets. OK. If they do these little small short flights, short flights. OK. Yes. Like from town to town or city to city, yeah. like he's concerts like, or like to go to dinner. It depends. It really doesn't matter because it's their jet. Okay. And they can do what they want one side. But they're buy they're buying their own gas. Yeah. So what's the problem? Because of the fuel, apparently. But they're buying it. I know. With they're their not, money. They're saying that it's the fuel. It's the same amount of fuel, regardless of whether it's carrying people or not. Because Drake was like, okay, sometimes we're not using it for an actual flight. We're using to move these planes to another airport. But they're saying, like, the fuel. Like, you know, the air and... Like it's wasteful and all that. Like the stuff. environment. Yeah. Go green. Look, let me tell you something. If I had a if I had a private jet, <laughs> are you taking it everywhere? I'm, I'm taking it to dinner. My wife and I are flying it from Ocean Pines to Ocean City. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Taking her on a romantic yes. flight. A romantic so, flight. Celebrity um, drama and their jets. So I didn't know that it was a thing and that people actually, like, make this be a thing and it's trending and it goes back and forth. Big money problems. Yeah, I had no idea. I just thought, like, they get on their flight and it's their jet and keep it moving. Okay. Aaron Rodriguez has it. J-Lo has one. Drake has one. I mean, there's so many celebrities that have their own private jets. From home to work in a private jet. So, that's, that's what I'm doing. I mean, hey, as long as you're here by 559. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right? Right? <laughs> All right, so Got Aaron Rodgers. Aaron Rodgers. Did you see that yesterday with him and the video? I did not. The way that he showed up at training camp? No. Okay, well, this was like a funny thing going. I'm okay. surprised you didn't see it. Adam Schefter had it first. Okay. And I was dying laughing. So um, when you're the reigning four-time NFL MVP champ, you roll up to training camp however you want. And you can even... Look like Nicolas Cage from Con Air if you want. So his hair is like slicked back. It's long. He has on a white tank top, a pair of jeans, his boots. And Aaron Rodgers was going for that look yesterday. Again, he showed up with his long locks, his facial hair, blue jeans, boots. He even posted a picture of himself with a shot of Nicolas Cage from the 1997 movie. In the caption, he says, Oh, I see the video here. What do here. you think I'm going to do? I'm going to save the beep day. Yeah, I see the video here. And he also dropped like a classic line from the movie. Um, but people are talking about this nonstop. I love it. 
And when he first got out of the car, I guess he had like a bag and then he dropped it. And now everybody's like, why did he drop the bag? What's in the bag? What is he doing? And I'm like, it's Aaron Rodgers. Who cares? I know it's in his Let bag. Let him drop the bag and drop those jaws. <laughs> <laughs> We're done. Just drop it all, Aaron. Just drop it all. Well, I was going to say, I know it's in the bag. His horse meds. Oh, stop. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! Here's Drake and Sticky. Good morning. <laughs>